In this video, we're going to learn the patterns of the left hand. Now, why would we need patterns of the left hand? Well, quite simply, patterns uh, are what really uh, makes the music. You know, it's one thing to be able to hear the notes in your head before you play them, and uh, it's another thing to also be able to say, okay, I'm going to put this finger down and that finger, but actually, at the end of the day, in order to play uh, the right notes in tune at the right times, you have to have a visual uh, construction in your mind of where the fingers are going to go. So uh, I'm going to teach you the most basic patterns right now and then what we're going to do in another lesson is uh, play some scales and we'll talk about scales later but we'll play scales that use uh, some of these patterns or most of the patterns. But the basic patterns today that I'm going to teach you are called whole, half, whole, that's pattern number one, and half, whole, Whole. Now, what am I talking about with holes and halves and everything? Well, basically, a whole step is the distance between two fingers that do not touch each other. A half step is the distance between two fingers that touch each other. So, just take your hand right now, your left hand. Let's make a whole half hole. All you have to do to do that is hold these two fingers together, the middle two fingers. You have a whole step right here, a half step right here, and a whole step right here. Let's do the other pattern, a half whole hole. These two fingers touch, half, whole, whole. So um, that's how you do the patterns. Now we're going to transfer that to the violin. Starting on the E string, remember to set your hand up like we talked about in the lesson on setting the left hand. We did that, and around. Elbow underneath the string that you plan to play on. So in this case, we're going to keep our mouse holes with our first fingers, which we talked about in that former lesson, and we're going to do the E string. Now, we're going to do half, whole, whole. How do we do that? Half, uh, sorry, whole, half, whole. Whole, half, whole means whole step, half step, whole step. Whole step, half step, whole step. These fingers are apart. These are together. These are apart. Now, I bet you want to know how that sounds. Let's take our thumb, put it on the corner of the fingerboard. First pluck, no fingers. First finger with the mouse hole. Whole step, half step. Whole step. That's how that sounds. Let's do it on the A string, the exact same pattern. Whole, half, whole. First finger. Whole, half, whole. D string. Bring that elbow around under the string. That means the elbow comes to the right. Whole, okay, first finger. Whole step. Half step. Whole step. G string. Bring that elbow around even more. That's it, so whole half whole. The next thing we're going to do is the half whole whole pattern, which if you remember is like that. Half whole whole is a little bit more complicated because first and second fingers don't naturally want to come together, so you have to scrunch that second finger up so much against that first finger, almost so that the second finger is like on the, almost on the cuticle of the first finger. Let's start with the E string. First finger, scrunch it up, now a whole step. Whole step. And again, we'll do it again. First finger with a mouse hole. Now scrunch up without tension. Tension. A string. Elbow around. Hole. Hole. D string. Elbow around. Half step. Whole step. Whole step. And G string. Really bring the elbow around. Whole, half step. Whole step step. And that is how you play the basic left hand finger patterns.